Hello, once again, Zen here. Welcome back to my OP of Pokemon Moon. In the last episode, we defeated all the members of the Elite Four. And in this episode, we're gonna go to our throne and claim it. Before you do, though, you might want to put a grass, fighting, or water type up in front. Because I say so. Because that'll make our life a whole lot easier. Anyway. If I had to take a guess, that's... Okay. Let's not go ahead. Let's not get ahead of ourselves now. There's our throne. <gasps> Let's go to it. I noticed that the background is nighttime because I'm playing in the day and moon. That makes it a little bit more pretty. Technically. Wouldn't be the same if it was daylight outside with all that crystal and stuff. Oh yeah, you're the, now the Pokemon League champion. Alright. Wouldn't it be nice if it was that simple? What do you mean? The truth is, there's one more person you have to battle if you want that title. Oh yeah, the champion. I forgot about that. No, I didn't. <sighs> but who is the champion? We haven't seen him yet. And of course, that trainer is me. Nah, he's been the champion since the beginning of the game. <laughs> oh, I, I skipped that lock. Let's that's how a battle worthy at this moment. I didn't mean to skip his dialogue. Not like I was going to voice act it well anyway. Watch that screen. We are challenged by Professor Pokemon. Pokemon Professor. I got that backwards. Oh my god. Kukui. There you go. He has a lichen rock. His rock, his rock broke of all, and now it's extremely strong. It's also the midday version. So that means you can have that in your Pokedex, you know. If you're playing Moon. Or the, how it looks. He has level 57. What do I want to do first? Is it weak physically? Nah, probably not. So it's sparkling Aria. It's gonna use Stone Edge. Wait. I'm surprised I survived that. But I thought he was gonna use something else. And that's why I was debating if I want to use Aqua Jade or not. Well, fine. I'm actually happy about this. Because he could potentially use um, Stone Edge. Or, no, not Stone Edge. Stealth Rock on his first turn. And that screws a lot of players over. Luckily, he didn't do that to me. Magnezone, I'm going to switch to Barbie. Because I have Earthquake, and that will destroy it. Actually, before I do that, I want to heal um, Jamie up. So I so I can have her for something else if they need be. No wait, no. Max potion on E. Flash cannon. I don't think that's gonna do much to me, even though it kinda did. But my stamina's gonna go up. Too bad I won't be able to use that in fully because um uh Oh. Hopefully it doesn't like get a crit on me, that'd be awful. No, 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 no! Or he could just KO me. Fine. <sighs> yeah, I guess. I have a break break move. I'm pretty sure I could tank it. So I'm just going to use something like a max revive. I have like eight of them. So I'm fully prepared for this. Thunder wave. Okay, then he's slower than usual. You make me not move. So I use some of my rare candies off screen as well. Just a little bit more. I used all of them actually. Free break. It doesn't do much because it's you know, I don't have the type, you know, stab. But that's fine. Thunderbolt. He's not gonna heal it yet. Because um uh, uh, let's see, do I? I do want to. You know what? You know what? You know what? Full restore. Um, I may get by with the items a little bit more than usual. Or, or do I do that all the time? I don't know. But I don't want to lose. Uh, or let any of my Pokemon, like, faint towards the end of the battle. You know? I want them to all be alive. And also create. Great. Great break. He's not gonna heal just yet because he's not in the range to heal. Uh oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes! 
Magnemite? Mag Magnus owned us down. Did, did I call it Magnemite a moment ago? I did. Wasn't paying attention if I did. 61. Braviary. I don't know what to use here. Sparky. I'm not gonna heal Yangus for right now. I might need to use him later though for something. That I know that he has. I'm actually for guys' team a little bit. Only a little bit. Thunderbolt! No, I'm not gonna KO it. I can tell because the sc it'll scroll down up. Really? Really? No! Anita! Why? Why'd you have to pick her? Sparky, please come back out. That bitch just gonna keep doing it and annoy me. I'm so fast in it. Tell when. That means all his attacks are gonna go first, I believe. Probably, I think that's what that means. So let's use Thunderbolt again. If he doesn't- okay, good. I'm so fast in it. So maybe that wasn't it, what I was thinking before. Or maybe it's just like physical attacks go first, so blind types, I don't know. Very specific things. Snorlax. Oh boy. I don't really have anything to counteract to that. Except maybe Barbie? No. Oh. I'm unsure. I have I have my own Snorlax with Brick Break, but I don't know if it, I can take on his Snorlax with whatever he has. I'm gonna use superpower. Body slam? <laughs> that looked kinda funny. Because it, it didn't go completely off screen. And ow! Does this have recoil damage? I wasn't really reading the description. Or something. Attack, defense. Oh boy. <laughs> I just had my defense right. No, wait! I didn't mean to click that. I actually meant to click Earthquake. Or go up towards it. Whoops. I'm sure I'll be fine. There we go. I just switch out. Didn't get any defense buffs to stay. Oh well. The eight. Nice. Petered out. Nine tails. Oh. I I know what to use here. What am I thinking? It's Pepper. I actually didn't see this on the way up from Mount La Lana Keeley because it's not in my version of the game. But here's a low one, nine tails. It's so beautiful! I actually used one in, on my team. And, um, sun. Look there. Ha! It missed. No! I didn't KO it. Uh, what should I do now? Oh, I know what I should do. He's gonna heal, so I'm gonna use toss it. Cersei hasn't really healed this fight, which is kind of worrying, because he'll just use it all in the last Pokemon. Which is upsetting. Guaranteed to KO in 8 turns. I think, I, because that's what Badly Poison does, I believe. Like, it gets worse and worse every turn. Uh, Flanker. So you save- You were- You used that way too late. Unless he's setting up for his next Pokemon, which is kind of true. Oh, come on. Oh. I, don't, I was going to complain I didn't KO it, but now I did because of poison. Yay! So it's a part fairy type now. I forgot to mention that. So that means poison was doubly effective. Oh boy. Was that MO weak right now? There is the starter that nobody chose. At least in my flicker. Uh, toxic. Oh yeah! Pfft. I am dumb, and I'm going to die. Oh, okay, I didn't die. But I had recoil damage. You know what that means? Unless he's going to use a Z-move, I'm... Hmm. Let's go for it. Okay, he didn't. Because I know his, his, this particular, you know, the starters he has, all have their Z moves equipped to them. Spear Shackle. This is um his signature move. Will it KO me? Yes, it did. Um, usually if it didn't KO me, it would have let me like you know 
It's, oh wait, no, 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 no. It would have um. How should I say this? It would have let me no longer escape or you know, you know, you know, retreat or you know, switch out. That's what I meant to say. What should I do? Pepper was really my only hope, but wait, no, no. Why actually? Yeah, let's go with this. And just tank it for a while. Get um, Pepper back on her feet. Wait, no. Let's actually not let's click things this time. There we go. He uses a full resort, and I'm going to revive. I'll keep um, Anita out for for now. No, no, no. And this is his last Pokemon, I just noticed. Uh, Petri! Ha! Ah. It knows a flying type move, but it's not really. Really. I forgot again! You know what? Spore. This time. Uh, that's not gonna help me this time. Or er, the, the refresh that kick in. Ow, 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 ow! Oh. Brick! It's fine. He had he had recoil damage, which is fine. Pepper, please come out again. And I should actually use Toxic and let it work it this time, because I have a feeling that's going to help if I survive the next turn. You know, if it doesn't like heal, I was going to switch out anyway. But it might kill me. Good, it didn't. I'm faster than it, so I am going to flank her. Unless he goes for the Z move, which he does not. Kind of a shame he didn't use the Z move because I wanted to show it. Oh, well, the poison didn't matter anyway. Well then. And Anita does not level up because she fainted. I couldn't win even though I went all out. What a refreshing feeling. Woo! That was money. Amazing. It's like I told you before, the strongest moves you can use are the ones that the trainers and their Pokemon chose together in the heart and heat at the moment when it really counts. And you just proved me right. Congrats, cousin. You're a champion we can all be proud of. I told you, didn't I? Up here on... Up there on Mount Hokulani. Man, the Pokemon and the trainers in the level really are the best. Around... Okay, never mind. Uh, oh, wait, I forget... I wanted to read that. It, fa it finally came true. And it's all thanks to you. You and your pre-marina. Starters for life at the beginning. Okay. And being said at the beginning there. Okay. Because he's at the front of my team. He. <laughs> I keep messing that up. I don't mean to. I'm so happy I got I, I got to battle you and your team here. Right where my dreams came true. And now? First ever champion of Alola? Pugan Lee? It's time to record you and your beloved team's achievement for eternity. Surprised this, this um, battle did not last longer than... It did when I first played. <laughs> Again, I was prepared for it, but whatever. Jamie! Sparky! Yangus! I'm gonna play you later. Uh, Barbie! Pepper! Pe what am I saying? I'm saying it's so weird. Anita! I'm sorry you got the faint. For the last battle. I'm so sorry. I didn't. I said at the beginning of the fight I wasn't going to do that, but oh well. No time to fiddle around in the champion battle. Congratulations, you are Alola's first ever champion. Let's look at my Pokemon and them scratch themselves, apparently. I'm so happy. Na, 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 na. Okay, there we go. Oh, <laughs> thank you for the stamp. <laughs> I thought it was just gonna be it. Okay. Everybody came to see me, even the little girl. You've entered the Hall of Fame, spectacular, much as the sun shines upon the moon. 
eliminating it. So you have friends you made during your island challenge eliminate your life. You've grown so much. You really do love your Pokemon with all your heart, don't you? Yep, that's precisely why she and her Pokemon were able to combine that strength to emerge victorious. What do you guys say? Now we're all going to be aiming for your seat. Help you ready for some rivals. Oh, we'll find them. <laughs> find them, Miss Golfer. The first ever champion of Alola's Pokemon League. Let's celebrate so grandly that even the sun and moon themselves will take notice. Ha! Alright, let's bust a U-turn to Melee Melee Island. Nice, nice. Okay. We're going to have a big festival in Iki Town. Don't worry. I'll be sure to let Lily know too. Oh, she's gonna come? Good. She's probably gonna make me do something that I don't want to do. Whatever. This is actually a very long ending. I just want to tell you guys that right now. So I'm probably not gonna voice everything. I'll just probably just comment on what happens. Because, you know. It's very long. Yay, I won! And Hal's happy because I won. It's all the younger trial captains. Hey, even even the electric one that I can't say. And the steel one that retired. Hey, there's Burnett and Kukui again. That's such a happy couple. And look at his mom and the old, and the Cantonian Meowth. Mom had to greet me this time, you know. Of course she did, she's my mom. Who are they waving to? Oh, it's Hapu and Lily. Nice. And Mustel. Sure. We'll add him too. There's not that much spoken dialogue here, I'm sorry. But it's good for my throat. <laughs> Here she is, the first Pokemon League champion from Alola. This calls for celebration, let's all get to it. There's my blank face. Hello. I like how some people have the same motions because they're lazy. Aw, hey Glideon. Lily. Aw, thank you Glideon. Can I have your number? No. Okay. Dang it! Oh, they're all doing their poses. How funny. Hey, where's Nanu? Oh. <laughs> Nanu. He's such an outcast. He knows what he's doing. But he went anyway. Nice. We didn't stay for long though, apparently. He just said hi and bye. <laughs> uh, to be honest, I'll probably do the same. <laughs> I don't like parties too much. I mean, I'll go to one, but I don't really stay for long. Anyway, let's not talk about that. Let's talk about how it's now nighttime. And it's Pokemon Moon. Okay, maybe there's not that much, since there's not that much dialogue going on, I can talk when there is dialogue. I just don't want it to be boring, okay? Congratulations on becoming the champion. It's amazing, isn't it? All these people are here just to help you celebrate this achievement. Everyone looks so happy, the adults, the children, even the Pokemon. It hasn't, it hasn't all been easy, but I'm really glad I came to Alola. Getting to meet you? No. It wasn't just meeting you, it was traveling together with you. I was glad I could, got to be a part of that journey. Hey Jennifer, it looks like the party is going to keep on going stronger, strong for some time, wouldn't you say? You think maybe we could sneak out a second and visit the ruins of conflict? I heard from Kahuna Hollow that the bridge has been fixed. Uh, what about the festival? It's just getting started. No, let's go. Let's go. 
I think Tapu Koko must be waiting. Or Coco. I'll say Cuckoo. No, that's not right. I'm sure it's waiting for you to come to it, Jennifer. Now that you've finished your island challenge. Now this really takes me back. Back with when I I could barely think about anything. I was so desperate. But thinking back on it now, it really was Nulala. I mean, it was Nebi who brought the two of us together, wasn't it? Come on, let's go. She has no trouble crossing that bridge anymore. Or any bridge. <laughs> to be fair, she wasn't the one who got on the bridge. It was me. I should be the one scared. You know? I hate this cutscene, by the way. Only because I can't get that Zagar cube over there. It's kind of annoying. And you can't get it till after the end game. Because you have to come back here to get it. Anyway, the ruins of conflict. I still wonder why it, Oh, I didn't mean to click that. Uh, was it because of some connection to Nuala? Okay. Um, if you just pause the recording, I'm sure you could read it. But what I accidentally skipped over. Let's just get to the end of the cavern, please. Or ruins. There reminds me of when Hapu became the ha Kahuna of Pony Island. My heart's still pounding in my chest. Is it because of the Sacred Guardian? Is Tapu Koko here with us? Maybe. I'm not even going to walk towards the thing. Because it does it all automatically for me. Great Tapu Koko. It was because of your help that Cosmog lived and was able to become Lunala. Lun Lunala. Eh. Please allow me to thank you on this behalf. Thank you so very, very much. It's your turn next. I want to see you show your appreciation to the way, the way that only a Lola's champion could. I know you could do it. I'll make sure your team is ready. Well, thanks. I figured I would have healed my Pokemon by now if I became champion, but okay. <laughs> Guess what? Guess what we have to do next? You reached out and touched the statue. You s you seem to hear a voice ringing in your head as it as through is coming through your Z ring. Oh, hello. It's his time. What? You're not Rafiki? Okay, never mind. Tapu Ko 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 Ko! I shouldn't imitate Pokemon Cries. I really shouldn't. We now get to fight and catch Tapu Ko Ko. Oh god, this is a bad matchup. But you know what I'm going to do? You'll see in a second. Let's switch to Barbie first, because um, it's an electric type, electric berry, to be more precise. So he won't affect me with like a strong, you know, electric attack. Agility? Okay. Notice it's the speed, right? Now I was about to say, if, if, if it races this evasion, I'm gonna call BS. Anyway, earthquake. You know what I'm gonna do? Besides him using nature's madness, which I think has your HP. Or 75% of it or something. No, it's half. Okay. Thanks for the... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to Earthquake it. You know why? I'm going to catch it later. You can re-catch it. I just want... I just don't want the episode for going on for too long, so I decided to KO it and save me the trouble for next time. <laughs> Sorry if that was a cop-out. But I had my reasons. I don't want this recording to be too long. It's already 25 minutes anyway. Bye, Tabby Coco. I'll catch you later. Ha ha ha. It still gives me something, though, I believe. A Z-Crystal clattered to the floor at your feet. 
Topium Z. Topium. It's another Z crystal. Tapu Coco, it may have, lo have lost that battle to you, but I don't think it was sad about that. I'm sure the two of you will meet and, and battle again someday. There's your hint that you can refight them. Him, at least. But I'm so glad we could come here. It has been weighing on my heart. Come on, we should get back to the village. If we don't return soon, everybody will realize that we slipped away from the festival. Yeah, we need to get back. How did they not notice I was gone? I'm just like this main celebration here. Everyone looks like they're all they're all they're they are having so much fun that I don't even think they noticed we left. <laughs> okay, if you say so. Oh, the battle royals are about to begin. Oh, I wonder who get the KO first. Oh, hey, look, it's the masked man or the masked royal. I wonder who will win. It's like Hapu. Or. Yeah, Hapu will win. That's the type of advantage. Meow! Well, he's gonna die. There's all the trial captains being shown. All the kid ones, first. Go, Meow! You, you can do it. Ah, pfft. Yeah, they revealed that there. That was obvious, though. The game hinted at it for a very long time. As blatantly obvious. But the people are too stupid to notice. <laughs> Only we are smart. Oh well. Doesn't really matter. I'm sure they'll figure it out eventually. The identity of the mass royal. A foot is actually getting. falling asleep. Oh no. I forgot his name. I, I, it's because I can't pronounce it. I know it's supposed to be K. It's a beautiful festival, isn't it? Everyone looks so happy. I hope that you always stay here the way, you, just the way you are now, with my blank stare. Sure. Look how, look how your joy has brought so much light to everyone here. I don't have a facial expression. How can I bring joy? Nah. Whatever. I think even my mother would have smiled and laughed to see this if she could have come. I think my mother's getting a bit better. She even tried to come tonight. I've been trying to help her understand what she did wrong, gently of course. But she needed some time to she needed someone to scold her. No crap. But the but in the process, I think I've discovered what I have to do next. What it is I can do? I'm going to, what, become a trainer? I look like forward to seeing it. Woohoo! Woohoo! Whatever. A bunch of fireworks. Was that a dog howling upstairs or was that something in the game? I don't know. I heard something wailing. But my dad's upstairs too, so whatever. Look at this, everybody's all fired up. We've got th the birth of the lowest strongest ever trainer to celebrate after all. I'm gonna keep training with Ilima for a while and then I'm gonna beat my grants for real at last. And then I'm coming for you, champion Jennifer. Ha ha ha. Hardy har har har. Jennifer. Sorry, I mean champion. I'm sure everybody here wants to see your partners too. Come on and show us your partners that we, that were there for so many of your discoveries, new experience, and adventures on your island challenge. Yeah, you pretty much use the same team the whole time, except for the the, the useful driftling. Whatever. Let's not talk about that. You're positively glowing. Thank you, Mom. I wonder if they're actually- No, I don't think they showed the, the models I had. Ooh. Yeah, they copped out. <laughs> they didn't want to put that stuff in.
Pokemon Moon. Here's the credits. They're actually very long. So I'm just gonna be quiet and let the music play if there is any music. Eventually. Maybe. And so Jennifer's Island Challenge came to an end. The festival to celebrate the birth of Lola's first champion lasted until late into the night. It was much, so much fun. I'm so glad I got to meet you all. These times in Alola will always be my most precious memories. This is Lily talking. The next day, dot, dot, dot. Oh yeah, I remember what happens next. There's still more of it. Of the ending. Whoops. You still haven't unpacked those boxes. Now I wonder what will happen today. A doorbell ringing? Well, is that the doorbell? Oh, well, uh, that's gotta be Kukui. Why don't you let him in? He's probably gonna let himself in. Like last time. Last three times, apparently. Or was it two? I don't know. Oh, I can't even save. <laughs> awesome. Jennifer! Oh, what? It's a disaster! A total disaster! Of uh, what? What's wrong? Oh, Auntie, evening. Sorry. Why are you calling him Aunt? Okay. I'll explain later, but, but Jennifer had to come with me right now. If we don't hurry, the ship's gonna, it's gonna be, it's gonna leave. I thought it said be late. Whoops. Why? Oh, I see. You know, Lily, Kanto is a long way, a long way away from here. Try not to let the jet lag hit you too hard. Burnett's, well, she said she'd be too hard, to be too sad to see, to watch you go. So she would, she wouldn't even come out with me. I know it's a lot to ask, but forgive her this time, would you? She did tell me to let you know the loft and the lab is, is yours to use indefinitely. <laughs> so you can come back and stay whenever you like. You didn't tell us. How I'm sorry, but I decided I have to go back. Have to go to Kanto to help my mother get better, but more than that, to help myself get stronger. Okay, I'm back. I had to be interrupted because of freaking dumb reasons. Anyway, the thought of going to Kanto also fills me my heart with excitement. I'm going to become a real trainer and meet all kinds of wonderful Pokemon. I'm going to travel all around Kanto, just like we did here on Alola for your island challenge. And no matter what happens on my journey, I'm going to be okay. Because of the smiles that you shared with me, you and Jennifer, and everyone here. Thank you all so much. And that's why someday, someday I'll come back to Alola again. But I haven't gotten to say any of the things I wanted to say to you. Oh, so, so ah, I'm going to send you a letter—a really, really long one. You better wait. I will how, and please take this. What was it, Jennifer? It may look a little worn, but that's because this was my most treasured belonging once. Oh. Then I suppose this is goodbye.
Well, I think that's gonna be it for now. I'll see you guys in another LP. Pokemon or not. See you guys next time. Um, a different Let's Play. Bye for now.